don't get punched in the face for thinking I'm just a YouTuber. This what a BMG niggas do. They get big racks, you feel me? You already know BMG got this city hot. That's a fact. the city hot. Don't fuck around. I'm double the gunner. They said they beef one upper. Niggas be chatting when I get the clap and them niggas gon' turn into runners. They said they beef one upper. Fuck is the two and I got a four for my nigga. I'm double the gunner. They said they beef one You make it hot on the book. I got a forty that's all in the curry. You better be fast on the foot. What's good, Stella King? It's your boy Apple Pass, and you are now tuned into the Realist Reaction channel on the two. I need everyone to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. Today I'm gonna be reacting to Lil Rich and Tazo B Step Up. You get me, but you know what I'm saying? Y'all saw that song in the intro, right? Y'all saw the song in the intro. That's my new music video. I need all of y'all to go check it out. Run up the numbers, man. Run up the numbers. We're already at 40 something thousand views in what five or six days, some shit like that. Run up the numbers, man. BMG got the city out for real. But anyway, before we get into the reaction, let me get into the song of the day real quick. Girl, I'm in love with the pain. He keeps on calling my name. Whole lot of diamonds and chains. Like we got some diamonds and chains. You know that just comes with the fame. I promise I never would change. But I wanna hang with the gang. But nothing was ever the same. Don't think for a sec that I'm stupid, but I'm about to lose it. All that drama that's for their amusement. Uh thought that you knew this. All my niggas, you know we go through it. Uh but don't be so foolish. In my bag and that's just how I do this. Get a bag and that's just how I do. Now that you heard the song of the day, if you like it, the link will also be in the description below. You can go check it out. But anyway, let's get straight into the stepper, man. See what they gotta say. Attention, attention. Ain't no drill song. Is this clock? Hey, ain't no drill song. Real Some real shit. Huh, you better invest in the shop. Who's in 30s or 40s or get you? <laughs> he gonna say, say no drill song. Some real shit, right? And then it start off with a drill beat and <laughs> drill lyrics. Yo, this nigga Lil Rich is a funny nigga. If I wanted, I take it. Hold up, what was he dropping just now? These niggas and dropping his times. What was he dropping? And now I'm the nigga who slide. Dropping these niggas and dropping their signs. Those niggas that really hit him. If I wanted, I take it. I really get it. We ain't them niggas you want to mention. Could we pull up on niggas we really wouldn't. And I'm always on go. I react too fast. You can die from a post. Can't drop my set. Don't move. Don't choke. Trust no bitch. Can't lie my bro. She pretty. I fuck her. Can't none of that pussy. Don't love me. Now, you know what's crazy? Ever since the corona shit, right? A lot of people been using the mask bars and shit. But I ain't gonna front. Everybody uses it kind of simple. It's not really like, you know, it's not really like, you don't gotta think about it. It's just so simple, you know? Oh, the mask is not for corona. The mask is not for COVID. The mask is not for the virus. Oh, we've been wearing masks before Corona. You know, shit like that. I'm a demon when a perky inside me. I got a gun on my hip. Run up on niggas, ain't shooting the mess. He get up, we hit him again. The shooter was little, they saying it's rich. He get litty whenever. Silence my weapon, I'm moving too clever. Nigga, you see me with steppers. Spending your size with 40s and better. We been in no matter the weather. Spending my dolly, I tell him no pressure. If she wanna fuck, then I let her. But she gotta set me with nothing. Look, better get back to my uncles. I'm on my way. This attack should be chronicled. He be like, you nigga, stop it. I'm fine. Family 
Yo, he gave me tight. He said he go Super Saiyan and the nigga dad look like one of them. <laughs> Dad looked like one of them Dragon Ball Z niggas with his hair, bro. No cap. Talking hot who pollute like me. So he's saying, bro, hold on, hold on, hold on. Put me back. When you talking hot who pollute like you, so he's saying, like, like your breath stink or some shit, like, will you be talking hot? He <laughs> pollute the air. Nah, I'll fuck with you. I get the ball, you feel me? Like, when you talking hot, like, you, you know what I mean? Who, who's. Now, I mean, who's saying toxic shit like you? You feel what I'm saying? I get what you're saying. Bitch, nobody out of the mood like me. Gang. Gang. I on front. This was, this was a calm track. The beat, eh, I ain't really, really feeling the beat too much. But, you feel me? It ain't really always about the beat and shit like that. But, I get it's a 7.9.5. Yeah, what are those type of ratings? 7.9.5 Like they, they both did their thing You feel me? They both good artists and shit Lil Rich and um, Tazo be good artists They just need to both be a little bit more consistent Especially Tazo B That nigga was wildin' Going dropping song after song after song Then just like his shit just slowed down I don't know what happened If he was going through something in life And got out the studio I don't know if he Ran out of money for studio time or visuals, I don't know. But he just fell off for a little bit where he wasn't as consistent as before. But he definitely a good artist. I think if he was to really like stay focused and get in his bag, that nigga could go somewhere too and shit. You feel me? And like try to alright, look. See when I be telling y'all the diss songs, right? I don't care if you make a diss song. You feel me? That's why a lot of people because I see people coming in the comment section. So I'm gonna I'ma just Speak on it real quick. People be saying, oh, yo, how you going to say this and say that and then you do this and do that. At the end of the day, I don't care if people make diss songs. But if you're going to tell your whole career on just diss songs and shit like that, it would never go nowhere. Because if you decide to make a different track now, nobody really relates to it because now everybody just knows you for dissing people and that's what they like you for. You know what I'm saying? So you want to show niggas how versatile you are. You make, I, right, I can make a diss track. I can make a song for females. I can make a party song. I can make, you feel me? A real nigga song. Shit like that. You got to show people. When I be saying that, yo, another diss track. It's not because, oh, yo, you should stop diss track. I don't care, bro, because at the end of the day, people going to have problems with each other. They're going to they gonna put it on tracks or whatever, have disagreements. I would rather y'all not, like, physically beef with each other. But if y'all wanted to diss each other on tracks for entertainment and for making y'all shit blow up to get money, I wouldn't really care. But the only thing I'd I be saying, like, some of y'all niggas would join a gang today and all of a sudden y'all got beef with all the niggas that that gang got beef with. And you just became a part of this shit. A nigga died 10 years ago. You rapping about him. You ain't even never got to meet the nigga. You putting him in your songs. Like, yo, bro, that was not your mans. That was the niggas in the gang that you're in mans. And a lot of y'all be getting that shit confused. A nigga say, oh, fuck that nigga that died. You never got to meet that nigga, but you over here ready to shoot a nigga over a nigga you never met. And then a dickhead gonna say, but yo, that's gang. But at the end of the day, my nigga, so you telling me, the same way y'all niggas be joining gangs and switching all y'all family members and shit because of the gang is cool too, right? Oh, that's loyalty. So who are you loyal to? Are you loyal to your gang or are you loyal to your family? Where's your loyalty? You feel what I'm saying? 
A lot of y'all niggas be having this whole shit all messed up because this drill rap shit got y'all thinking some type of way. And y'all taking y'all advice from a bunch of dirty niggas with nothing. Nothing. They don't understand nothing, bro. I'm telling you, yo, at one point, I never used to give a fuck about getting arrested. Like, oh, should I get arrested? Shit, I don't give a shit. Because that at that point, I ain't have nothing. You feel me? It wasn't nothing. Yo, I got money. I could go here. I could do this. Oh, yo, I have this to lose. I got a call. Damn shit. Who gonna pay my car insurance if I'm not here? Who gonna pay my rent? You got shit to lose, so you start thinking about these type of things. You feel what I'm saying? But when it's a little dirty nigga that don't got nothing, he's just gonna be saying a bunch of dumb shit. And that's who y'all take your advice from, and that's who y'all look up to. But I just had to drop that little jewel right there in the end, and you feel me? There's be a lot of dumb shit in my comment section. But anyway, man. BMG got the city high. Like I said, 7.9.5 on the rating on this shit. If you feel like I rated it too high or I rated it too low, comment in the comment section below and let me know. It's your boy Apple Class. After you subscribe, remember this. Whenever you watch my videos, it's all jokes, man. You gotta come over here and get a laugh. Don't hate me because I gave you a low rating. Hate yourself because you ain't make a fire song. <laughs> it's your boy BMG, man. Good. Bow.